Hey guys, this is Kuomo here. Today I'm going to show you a I'm going to show you a new soft a uh, new recording software which is called Microsoft Expression Encoder for Screen Capture. So, I've I've used this for most of my tutorials which uh, like the Bandicam, the DX Story and a few of my game my gameplays too. So, today I'm going to be uh, show you exactly how to use it so well first of all I uh, go this is your uh, recording device so when you download it from the link which will be given in the description below you'll get two softwares one is the expression encoder 4 the second the second one is is the uh, encoder for screen capture so once you capture, uh, once you do a screen recording, you uh, d you have to convert it into a um, playable uh, playable file type like WMV. So uh, what you have to do first is just look at the options. Go to the edit options. Choose screen frame rate. Can go up to sixty. But I usually like to keep it on 25 or 30. Capture my mouse pointer. Yes, camera. I don't really use my webcam at all. And audio settings. Yes, this is very important. So here the microphone, the speaker. This is a studio mix which I've never really used. And the good thing about uh, this uh, software is that you can only use the speakers, or you can like just do nothing no audio at all so you can use a mu any music file or anything so here are the hot keys so to start or pause your recording control shift f11 which is default to stop your recording control shift f12 again it's default to zooming uh, to zoom in it's actually control shift f9 if you uh, use the default settings but i've changed it to f5 which is much easier and here are the, some other settings which I usually use uh, for my tutorials. I use the mirror mouse pointer, and uh, yes, this counter is important for almost anything. My people or start pause is also necessary. Recording to uh, isn't really necessary if you could memorize the, uh, the hard keys. Flashing boundary, yes, for tutorials it is very important. And webcam as overlay is something which I'll tell you a little later. So go to help and much. And um, uh, this uh, this recording software has a time limit of 10 minutes. So if you so you need to make tutorials of only 10 minutes, but you can just record a game and make and ju then just put them together in any uh, editing software video editing software that is okay so click on ok then you can you see the webcam edit options here in the capture manager you can um, you can uh, choose the file location to save the screen capture files which is in, which is in the file uh, extension of X E S C yeah which actually stands for expression encoder screen capture okay so now I'm just gonna hit the record button to show you what what actually uh, it does so I've clicked on it and as you can see there's this boundary here, right here so let me get this up down so this was actually the one which I was using for my previous tutorial which was on the Bandicam Cracker if you notice over here so you can uh, click on this define capture area and you can just define this capture area so you can uh, basically what it does is you can go full screen or you can just choose this this part this much part of the of any software or you can only choose your taskbar or your, yeah your taskbar you could also only choose this, which is really stupid. This, this, this. Yes, yeah, so basically, this is very really familiar like, on the console. So, 
Okay, but I mean, oh no. Let me just click here. Okay. And uh, usually this this software that uh, cannot do full screen recording. So uh, so don't even try to full screen recording. The best thing you can do is just um, like uh, use this define capture here and uh, define uh, the software is such as this method expression for four. Okay, that's that's like the best thing to do. Okay, and now this is your toolbar where you can click on any custom area or full screen. It doesn't really work. I've tried it out. It did work for me. I'm not sure about you guys. But when you do it and it does not work, this size stops working and then uh, switch it on the game. Okay, so now let me just quickly show you how the recording is done. Okay, uh, if there's no space to display your toolbar, it says no no space to display. So it just shows you the hotkeys again and you have to memorize these as I said earlier. So Control shift F12 is, control shift F12 is what we're going to be using. And also the zoom. Okay, so the camera should appear at any moment. And what just happened? What just happened? Okay, it's gone. Okay, I'm back. Uh, so uh, some problem occurred and it just didn't record. So okay, this time I'm gonna try something different. Uh, make this really small, smaller, and yeah. Okay, let's just keep this in there. Okay, and where's it? Who was that? Where did my toolbar go? Where's my toolbar? Oh, okay. okay, so right now for some reason I can't see my toolbar, so I'm just gonna hit Control Shift F11 to start recording. Control Shift F11. Control Shift F11. Control Shift F12. Okay, I'm back again. So, yeah, something seriously went wrong and we started and got back. So, I finally found this my toolbar, but it half of it is missing. But at least the record button's there, so it's cool with me, man. Click on record, and yeah, here it shows 3, 2, 1, and there's the beep. Here's my boundary, and now I'm gonna. Oh, okay. Yeah, sorry guys, I pressed uh, the wrong button by mistake. So I can't really show you how to zoom in because my is recording this currently with Bandicam and F5, the hotkey for zoom in, was actually my recording thing for Bandicam. So, really sorry about that, guys, but. So it's recording and blah blah blah. So I'm moving and I'm gonna stop it. Hitting Control Shift F12. Stop and it shows me this. So I click on Send to Encoder. Here's my previous capture, which was done on the same day too. Oops, wait. Damn. Why am I opening another one? No, don't open another. Don't open another one. If I close this one, close this. Close. Close. No, I don't want to save any changes. Okay. So here is the preview, as you can see over here. Now I'm just gonna go and change this to fit the screen and play this. So as you can see, it's a decent, um, I guess, seven, seven twenty p or. Uh, close to yeah, 1080p maybe or something, but it's it's really good. You can you uh, don't really recommend it for games though. 
so pause this bring this back here um, well about uh, editing well you can't do much with editing actually so um, see you can like open file location at Click on the best quality. I'm going to zoom in with the mouse. Here, um, uh huh, yes. Yeah, so this looks like the best thing. And to encode, click over here, encode, or you can even go here, encode, and check the output formats. So by default, it's Windows Media. You can go to MP4 yes but you need the pro version and I have the free version which is unlimited and you can enhance this by pre-processing and increase the audio level or anything like that but just keep it at one so uh, yeah the visual overlay is um, something pretty cool which I'm gonna be showing you in a minute right here uh, yep, I got this Calvin Hobbs picture. So yeah, so now wait, let me just fit this to screen, and this is an overlay which I can put anywhere. Like um, if you might have seen some big YouTubers, um, like who play stuff like. Uh, who play gameplays and like when they're like showing you their loadout or something they have this uh, come up to the bottom left of the screen yes so you could take a snapshot of your loadout and put it over here uh, and you can just add it over here but you could use other softwares for this I mean like Vegas or something but I'm, I'm fine with this one uh, you can move around then this is for editing it you can just move it in between you can make it longer this way or anything you can even change this cut it short cut it long cut it short cut it long you can't really move it because uh, this is the only overlay I mean, this is the only video which I have what just happened what just uh huh. Uh huh. Yes, here it is. And it's back here. Then, uh, yeah, I was here. So you can do that. You can add an overlay. But I don't really recommend doing that. Then you can go metadata. I have no idea what this means. Uh, okay, you can add a title like uh, trial. Then author one more copyright yes rating ten I don't know what it is. okay rating sure credits description do not copy right. Okay, and output. So while you're going to output, you can publish this. What's web dev? I have no idea what that is. You can go to some security like okay, you need full version. Okay, just change this uh keep job keep job output and just click on encode. and as you can see it's pretty fast encoding when it shows yellow it shows it so that means it's on step one like here pass one of two when it shows it's green it's on the second step or sometimes it even shows you just the second step only uh, another three seconds a few more seconds okay so well to them let me just uh, give you an update on my games well I got a few new games like uh, Saints Row the Fourth Thief 
watchdog as you might have seen in my previous tutorial and I even have a gameplay of that already then I'm thinking of uh, getting Barlands 2 and uh, and my friend is giving me amazing spammer too so you will see many more gameplays in the next few um, you will see various kinds of gameplays in the next few weeks okay this this thing is taking uh, too long uh, let me just pause this video and be back when it's done okay I'm back guys and well it's done the clock is running too long and it's done it, uh, the clock will close and now I'm going to show you uh, how I'm going to show you the I'm going to show you the output so this is where it's been saved and look at the quality guys it's pretty good it's I think it's almost like 1080p oh and look I overlay I don't think I have it oh there no. look it's got a name try it let's go more and what else do you have uh, does it show the copyright no it doesn't show the copyright okay close this and let's just take a look at the properties what do the properties say what do the properties say okay here's the property uh, go to details description title trial subtitle there's no subtitle rating give it a final five tags no tag comments do not copyright please guys do not copyright this video video length frame width bitrate 64 kbps media contributing artists oh, oh yeah you your origin content parental rating mature blah 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 attributes it's a oh my god who gave it a okay guys that's about it with this tutorial uh, I hope you guys like and enjoyed this tutorial. If you want more such tutorials, hit the like button. If you want, uh, if you want me to keep posting, just subscribe if you want to. Oh, shit, wait, let me try that again. If you like this video, hit the like button. If you want to watch more of these videos, just hit the subscribe button, guys.